the very highest level, this is so ingrained in our mission to democratize AI for every seller. The change is open access to everyone all the time. It's a partnership. We want to make it as easy as possible to be there at the very beginning of your journey. All right, Alistair, another conversation. This time we're getting in the weeds on a very specific subject. We're talking about democratizing information, technology, education, all in the context of take a metrics and flywheel. So maybe we should give some context. When we're talking about free, when we use that word, what does that mean? What does that look like within the take a metrics platform? Well, you know, we're here as a company to help as many sellers and brand owners as possible. We want to help them maximize their potential on the most valuable marketplaces. We want to do that with technology and a really, really powerful way to do that is to give them accessibility. We've put a huge amount of work into our new platform, Flywheel 2.0. Firstly, we want everyone to be able to test and use the software and use our AI with no cost, no risk. And uh, we've taken away the credit card requirement that was in Flywheel 1. So any user, regardless of size, can, can sign in, use the technology. And then in, in terms of the actual business model and in terms of our actual pricing model, if you're below a certain threshold and the threshold that we're using is $10,000 of GMV or total monthly sales, it is completely free to use the AI technology. The goal there is we want, we know how hard it is to start out as a seller and scale on a platform like Amazon or Walmart. It's a partnership. It's, it's an opportunity to help a seller get to a certain size. And we've seen these incredible stories where entrepreneurs, brand owners, big or small, have launched on marketplaces and have scaled very quickly. We want to make it as easy as possible to be there at the very beginning of your journey. It's less about um, free in the sense of a value being being given away for nothing. It's about a partnership and it's about us proving value. Free is an opportunity for take -a metrics to show what it can do. Yeah. And I think that's just so important. There's so many different solutions out there. There's so many different you know challenges. We want to be considered as a, as a really important part of your business and um, you know, retail's really hard. There are uh, so many different cuts into your margin, into your gross margin, um, marketplace fees, shipping fees, rising shipping fees, by the way, advertising costs. We want to be on the, the mission of continually helping optimize all of those to, to, to really make you more money and grow. Looking ahead to what's next, how is this concept leading into the future of take a metrics and what's to come? We have billions of dollars worth of transactions going through our platform. We have billions of dollars of ad spend going through our platform. We work with thousands of sellers. We want to compile the learnings. We want to compile the insights, the hard facts that only we have because of the scale. And we want to package that in an educational format that's truly valuable to every seller. And that's what you've done, Cameron, with AdMax and the team. And it's been a tremendous success. We want to just keep doing that. You know, we're really proud of that opportunity and we want to give it back. And we want to give it back to help every single seller. Especially at the scale that's required to perform well in e-commerce nowadays, the, the things that you have equipped yourself with and the people that you trust really matter. You know, that word trust is so important. I mean, we're really proud that... Um, you know, so many businesses have performed extremely well with us. And, you know, that leads into this um, flywheel of our own, you know, this, these insights, the scale of our data set, the ability to understand what works and what doesn't work. That's what every seller wants to know. How do you succeed? What is the playbook? What should you be automating? Which ad types? What should I do with various scenarios? And you know we're in a position because of our learnings, because of our data, to be able to actually provide that. Mm -hmm.